Round seven of the World Rallycross Championship and Sunday's action from the spectacular Spa Francorchamps. Johan Christofferson, winner of round six yesterday, leading the championship with 111 points. But Kevin Hansen, Ole Christian Vaby, and Timmy Hansen all tied for second on 78. Today is a big day. Heat one, race one, and Ole Christian Vaby back after all the technical issues from yesterday. He started on pole with Kevin Hansen alongside him. A good launch from the Volkswagen driver, and Vaby took a lights to flag victory. Really nice feeling to fight back from yesterday with all the issues we had, and you know I was barely on the track yesterday, so uh, it's, it feels good to have the pace. Race two and Johan Christofferson leading on the way out of turn one, while Nicholas Gronholm was all out of shape. Christofferson pushing hard, but the Volkswagen driver picked up a right rear puncture with spectacular consequences. Hansen stuck it up the inside of the hairpin and went on to take the win. Christofferson's Volkswagen, though, was a mess. That was uh, maximum uh, attack all the way. I knew I lost a little bit of time there with Johan's puncture, so... Uh, yeah, and, and maybe just at a good time, so I was absolutely on it and, and no relaxing, even though maybe, you know, I was on the, the only one finishing. On to the second round of heats, and race one saw Johan Christofferson make this pass stick at turn four, stealing the lead and the win from Nicholas Gronholm. That corner invites to try something, and, uh, and I did. I saw Niklas was a little bit wide the corner before, so I managed to get up the inside and uh, yeah, managed to put in a good lap after that. So uh, yeah, that was, that was fun. Race two, and Timmy Hansen had to respond to Christofferson's win, and he did just that. But he had to work for it. He picked up a puncture, but fortunately for him, so too did everyone else. An action-packed race. Hansen winning from Clara Anderson, Ole Christian Vaby and Gustav Bergström. The progression rounds came next, and Timmy Hansen set the pace, taking yet another win, followed home by his brother Kevin in race one. I won a few progression races this year, but it doesn't say anything really, so need to just stay focused and keep racing, keep enjoying. Progression race two, and this time it was Johan Christofferson who had to respond to Hansen's pace. He kept the pressure on, winning from Gustav Bergstrom with Vaby third. Into the semi-finals then, and just keep your eye on the yellow PWR machine of Nicholas Gronholm going off P3. Another mind-blowing start from the Finn. He was leading coming out of turn one and went on to win. Meanwhile, Timmy Hansen dropped to third and was left with some work to do, but things went from bad to worse for the Peugeot driver. Spinning on turn four with damaged rear right suspension, he crossed the line last and his day was done. Semi-final two, and Johan Christofferson took a lights to flag win from Kevin Hansen, both progressing through to the final, along with Ole Christian Vaby. That last corner is really tricky, and uh, yeah, I, I tried to be safe on the lap when uh, Kevin was in the joker lap, but uh, yeah, it was a tricky one, but uh, yeah, finals are very important. Christofferson, Gronholm, Hansen, Bergstrom and Vaby. It was a tasty lineup for the final here in Spa, and as has been the case all weekend, Gronholm got a great launch. It all got a bit fruity going down into turn one, Ole Christian Vaby picking up damage and retiring. But it was Christofferson who hung on to lead the pack up Eau Rouge for the first time. The Swede got his head down and started banging in hot laps to build a lead. Meanwhile, behind, it was all kicking off. Nicholas Gronholm getting it wrong through turn four and leaving the door open for Gustav Bergstrom to move up to second. Meanwhile, Kevin Hansen, who had jokered early, was looking to reel in Gronholm, but this spin sealed his fate. Gronholm repassed Bergstrom when he jokered and he moved back up to second. But up at the front, it was Johan Christofferson who kept himself to himself to take his 33rd career win here in Spa-Francorchamps. 
Yeah, it was a, was a tough day today, but uh, in the final I had uh, warm tyres from the semi-finals, so I had a very good start. From there on, uh, yeah, I managed to take the lead. And uh, yeah, I was very cautious in the last corner because it was quite rutted there, and which means it's easy to pick up a rear puncture. So I took it quite easy, but I had a big gap uh, to the cars behind. So from there on, I just tried to to be safe going to the finish and uh, yeah, being able to take uh, another win. So Christofferson does the double here in Spa. He may not have been the quickest, but he was certainly the smartest this weekend. The World Rallycross Championship heads now to Spain for the next double header. Who's been your driver of the weekend? And can Johan Christofferson wrap up another title in Spain? It's certainly looking good. We'll see you in Barcelona in three weeks' time.